rolling up over black Cadillac High heel boots and a sexy body full of tats Baby's bad, oh baby's hella bad After her there ain't no coming back Wanna take a run at that I think she's feeling me, turn it up a few degrees My imagination of her body gets the best of me Oh god she's such a tease, bitten lips, bruised knees I'm What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. We've got a great one for you today. We have built the world's first 1/7 scale high-speed diagnostic dyno. This thing is outrageous and there is a lot going on guys. Let's just take a look at it. All right. What we've got is we have high-speed rollers all even on the same plane with the same level of resistance. And back here, we have a meter that is able to uh, measure the amount of pounds of uh, pull that these RCs have. Now, in the event that one of them should get away, we have a very high uh, tensile chain back here that is attached to a different point just in case things get out of control. We've got the sinister diesel uh, trim going on. Wow, what a cool machine. All right, moving up front, guys, we have some more tie downs and we have two fans. Uh, you'll see what those are for later um, when we do our demonstration, but this is just one of the coolest things I have ever seen in the RC world and I am absolutely positive it's going to change the racing RC world and you're going to about to see why and let's go right into it guys. Wow guys the possibilities for this really are endless so let me tell you what I'm talking about here. All right so this is going to be the view that you're going to have as you're uh, vehicle is traveling at whatever speed you deem necessary to make your corrections 50 60 70 whatever we've actually had this up to 80 miles an hour and i don't think that triple digits is a um, is very far off so just imagine if you will being able to look at the vibration of your drive shaft uh, safely while traveling 100 miles an hour at the wheels just imagine being able to look at your servo and your servo saver and make sure that they're in sync. Being able to make real adjustments to your suspension, your sway bar, and your turnbuckles in real time, guys. You guys would be really shocked, just like I was, to find out by making little adjustments while this car is moving very fast, you can see what a difference those sway bar makes. Just give it a little bit uh, uh, of a loosen up and you can see this front end start to move back and forth. The rear the same, you loosen it up, you can see the rear end going back and forth, you tighten it up and uh, it gets steady again. The turnbuckles, you can get those just right and you can see where your wear is on your tires uh, all safely guys while operating it on your workbench. Can you imagine this out at the racetrack, being able to see how your race car pulls? Uh, when it launches off the line, does it pull to the right? Does it pull to the left? Uh, what type of small adjustments need to be made? All the adjustments that you can't see, that you wish you knew about, you can see all of this just like this, all while safely operating. Uh, your car at high speed. Have you ever had a bearing that's squeaky and you know you have a bearing going out but you're just not sure exactly where in the car that it's going out? Well, just look at it this way. You can have your car running higher and higher speed. Find out that magic speed that that bearing starts to squeak and then you can get in close and you can find out exactly where that squeak is coming from without all of the headache of dealing with it until the bearing completely explodes and ruins a dip housing or something much worse. So I think the possibilities for this are 
just through the roof. Hopefully you guys will let me know down in the comments what you guys think of it. Was this something that you guys would like to see more of? Uh, being able to test uh, high speed cars at 100 miles an hour while being able to work on them right on the bench. How cool is that? And if you guys want to have a grudge match with your friends, you've got a meter out back and you can safely judge and accurately find out how much pull your RC has off the line. You can even tear it uh, to make sure that everything is nice and tight. Guys, this is all sturdy. This is on there. Uh, the front has a little bit of, uh, of ability to play, but we want that little bit of play so we can make those suspension adjustments uh, and fine tune at high speed. So, but the bottom line is the back is sturdy. It is not going anywhere. Um, all right, guys, let's fire this thing up and let me show you what exactly I'm talking about. All right, guys, we're about to fire up the infraction. I wanted to show you guys that we have these cooling fans on right here. Uh, they have three different speeds, but they can keep everything cool and simulated like you're driving down the road. So the only thing that this can't really do is downforce as you're uh, making your way down the highway. However, I think uh, the trade-off uh, is um, very well worth it. All right, guys, so let's uh, let's fire up our remote. I want to show you guys something. You know, one of the good things that the throttle uh, trim is good for is what you're about to see here today. If you never thought you'd use it, think again. All right, so we're going to bring this car up to speed. All right, guys, imagine being able to make these turnbuckle changes right here in real time. Being able to adjust your suspension and seeing what happens, what the result is. You can actually adjust your sway bar right there in real time. But how cool is this? You guys get to see all of this in action. Now, of course, we've got it at low speed because we don't want to drown you guys out with the sound because uh, RC traveling at 100 miles an hour is awfully loud, but you can see what we're talking about. You can see the motion and the movement. See if your tires got a wobble. See how everything uh, works? The possibilities are really endless, guys. Make small adjustments wherever you need. Look at the vibrations. Find squeaky bearings. Guys, it is really incredible what you're able to do and all at high speed, all while watching exactly how your car is behaving uh, while those uh, wheels are turning at 100 miles an hour plus. I can't wait to see the possibilities of this, guys. It, uh, it's very, very exciting. Believe me, if you could see me, I am smiling ear to ear. Uh, I think this opens up the possibilities of not only uh, possibilities here at the Radioactive RC Ranch, but also possibilities for real drag racing and high re speed racing scenarios. Uh, for one seventh to one tenth RC cars. I am just absolutely excited about this build and I'm so glad that it came together and we were able to share it with you today. All right, guys, until the next one, we will see you radio heads later. Right, guys, I've been waiting a while to show you my new toy. Let's do some dyno pulls and see how the infraction does. Cause you're trying to stay strong and fake a smile until I look away But I've known you too long, it hurts to watch your blue eyes fade to grey As 
you fade away As you fade away Yeah, I'm about to fade away Cause every time I wake up I feel like it's Monday Something's going wrong with all the chemicals up in my brain All of a sudden I don't look at anything the same way Gotta build up of my thoughts sitting in an ashtray I'm sorry that I'm so inconvenient, okay Just let me be